What you guys got another video here for you. In this one, we're going to be taking a look at Locomoto, aka uh, Windows Security. Um, there's tons of these on the internet, and uh, as you can see, what it does is it blocks your computer. Now, if we restart and try to get into safe mobile networking, I'll show you what happens. So, what we'll do is we'll go into safe mobile networking. And soon as this loads up, you should get the um, Windows security uh, issue there that you've got. Now, that said, to remove this is going to be pretty tricky if you don't have nothing on your system to remove it. So what we're going to do is manually remove it. You can use tools to remove this. So what we're going to do is go back into um, advanced options and uh, go into um, system restore with command prompt and I'll show you how to do that now if you don't know how to get into there the instructions should be on the screen right now so once we're in advanced options we're going to come straight down to safe mobile command prompt and boot into there okay so we're at the command prompt with uh, in safe mode here so what we're going to do is we're going to type in here explorer open that up and close that window off now now there will be a file that you've clicked on that's created this problem and this will be the file here okay on my desktop but what we're going to do is just go into reg edit here and we'll open up the registry editor and let me just resize this down so we can see what we're doing here okay so we've got some options here uh, what we want to do is go into H key current user and then we want to come down to software once we get down to there we want to come down to where it says Microsoft and pull that down until you see Windows then current version and then straight down to where it says run now inside there you will see that file on the desktop it's pointing to that file so we're going to delete that key and once we've done that we're going to go back up here just close that one back off and then go into Windows NT current version and then we're going to pull down here to where it says win logon go there and you will see a file inside here let me just pull this across so you can see here, I'm just going to pull that right across here. And there you can see the culprit there, it's the shell file. Okay, so we're going to delete that file. That's that one done. Okay, so we're going to close that back off. Okay, so now that's been removed, we can now remove this file safely from the system and we can now reboot our system back to the normal mode okay as you can see the uh, infection has now been cleaned but it's always good to run some scans with some other tools like Malwarebytes and Hitman Pro so just run a scan with uh, the free version of Malwarebytes, just do a, an update and run a quick scan, okay? Now once that's complete, you should be back up and running, okay? Now if you have got other infections on your system, you will have to run other scans with other tools. If you don't know what tools to use, then you can look at some of my other videos to let you know what other tools you can use, okay? Anyway, but I think we're going to wrap this one up. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. I hope this video helped you out. If it does, then hit the like button, guys. It really does help me out. And also hit the subscribe button if you want to be notified when I upload new videos. Now, if you've got any video requests or any ideas for videos, then put them in the uh, comments section down below, and I'll do my best to make those videos for you guys, okay? So thanks again for watching, guys, and thanks for your support. Bye for now.